Начнем занятие. Today's in organic part of soil. Органическая часть почвы. Plan of the lecture. The value of the organic matter of the soil. Значение органического вещества почвы. Composition of soil organic matter. Это состав органического вещества почвы. Здравствуйте, Нурга Лебутяшевич. Расчетно подключились и еще сейчас не видать никого. Да, да, просто я хотела сказать, что мы с Экономковым отметиться забежали, а потом пойдем в 14.10 в этот Валматинский. Можете нас отметить, пожалуйста? Soil humus. Это гумус почвы. The soil contains living organisms, plant remains, <coughs> insects, microorganisms, products of their vital activity, and the humus formed during the soil formation process, which constitutes the organic part of the soil. The organic part of the soil has a great influence on soil development and the formation of its properties. Organic soil contributes to better accumulation of nutrients, the formation of favorable physical properties of the soil, sanitary protection of plants. In the 19th century, research on the organic part of the soil in Germany was carried out by Sprengel, Sweden, Vercelius, Russia, Thurman, Kostlicek, and others. In the 20th century research in this direction was continued by Williams, Orden, Schreiner, Short, and the uh, Waxman. A great contribution was made and uh, received unique data of the study of the organic part of the soil. Turin, Kornova, Alexandrova, Panamarova, Arlov, Kaurichev, Pike, Bishopfoot, uh, Schnitzel, and others. In Kazakhstan studies of the organic part of the soil were carried out by Vishnevskaya, Bildibayeva, Kirushin, Yulubayev, Kurushpay. In soil, the main part of organic matter is represented by humus. On average, its content is 85 percent of the total mass of organic matter in the soil. Entered into the organic matter of the soil, the semi gelatinate plant remains insects make up 10 percent and living organism 5 percent. Humus is high molecular nitrogen organic compound formed from groups of genus structure group according to similar general properties, but each group differs from the other with their own property, composition, and structure. The substances that form part of the humus are divided into two groups. The first group includes simple compounds 
in the bright amino acids, proteins, organic bases, and acid sucrose. The amount in humus is insignificant and amount to several percent. The second main group includes specific substances, humus compounds. Humus compounds depending on the solubility are divided into the following groups. Phallic acid, humus acid, human, Pelvic acid are mobile, highly soluble in water and other solvents. Compared with humic acid, have a light molecular weight and less contain carbon. Acid properties and well pronounced the solution has a light yellow color. Much is contained in pazolic gray soils and the crassnoziums. Humic acid is slightly soluble in water, in insoluble in mineral and organic acid. Molecular mass is high, contains more carbon. Ace properties are not quite noticeable compounds. It dissolves in an alkaline medium. The color of the solution is dark brown, brown. The salts of given and calcium 2 plus and the magnet 2 plus cation are also slightly soluble. Humic ace and more abundant in chernozoom and the chestnut soil. Humic and insoluble, non hydrolysable constituents of humus matter. They consist of soil minerals strongly associated with humic and the hydric acids, slowly decomposing plant residues in the bracket, cellulose, lignin, etc. Gematomelanic acids by properties intermediate substances between humic and the pelvic acids. Depending on the environmental condition, they can be in the composition of humic or pelvic acids. Humus formation. The primary source of organic substances in the soil and the biosphere as a whole and the autotrophic organisms. They are capable of synthesizing organic substances from mineral compounds. In terrestrial ecosystems, primary organic matter was created mainly by green plants. At the same time, microorganisms, insects, and the remains of various animals play a role in creating the organic matter of the soil. On the earth, for each hectare of the soil surface, one to tons of plant residues enter the tundra annually. And in the humid tropics, these figure reaches 30, 35 tons. In the step, herbaceous plant leaves behind 10, 20 tons of mass. 20, 60 percent of the in the form of roots listed us. In agroecological systems, seven, nine tons of plant residues are received per hectare of land annually. According to Tiryushin, in break 1993, after harvesting spring wheat in the soil, there are four nine tons of plant residues. 
Each year, one hectare of soil receives 100 to 100 kilograms of remain of insects and animals. Organic residues that have entered the soil undergo biochemical and the physical chemical changes. Most of it turns into mineral substances, carbon dioxide, water and the simple salt, and part after passing through complex changes turns into humus. The process of transformation of organic substances into humus is called humification. There are different views on the process. Some in the bright canon of a uh, adhere to the concept of condensation. Other in the bright Williams uh, Gelter concept of biological and uh, in the bright Pure and Alexandrova biochemical oxidation. The concept of biochemical oxidation was proposed by Turing in 1930 and was continued by Alexandrova. By its definition, humification is the process of formation of specific organic compounds, which is then converted to humic acid as a result of complex biophysical, biochemical changes. In uh, uh, one degram hectare molecular substances during the decomposition of organic residues. Alexandra developed a manual on the process of humification and indicated in the decomposition of organic residues the synthesis of microorganisms, humus formation, mineralization, and inclusion of mineral in the biological cycle. The process of humification takes place in several stages. In the first stage is a result of biochemical oxidation, formation of humic acid, and the Zia complex variable cleavage uh, uh, observed in the composition of humic acid nitrogen substances appear. Human and the hydrogen acid split organomineral compounds are formed. At the last stage of the change in humic substances, humic compounds begin to slowly decompose gradually. The duration and the nature of humus formation depend on the amount and the composition of incoming plant residues. Humidity and availability, environmental reaction, microbiological features, and is related to the chemical, mineralogical and the granulometric composition of the soil. The value of humus, a energy and the nutrition found for biota. B, increases the absorbency of soils. C, improves the aggregate state of the soil and its water air region. Accumulation and uh, migration of humus in the soil pocket. A1 accumulated in the break horizon of accumulation of humus. A2 alluvial in the bracket carry humus down. B1 alluvial in the bracket bringing humus from above. B2 alluvial in the bracket bringing humus from above.
important role in humus accumulation is played by the speed of humification and mineralization. Humification is understood as a combination of biochemical and the physical chemical process, the result of which is the transformation of organic substances of an individual nature into specific humus substances, which uh, process certain common properties and the features of the structure. Mineralization of the resinous process, when considering the fertility of different soils, it is necessary to take into account the humus balance and its regulation. This balance includes the following items of income and the express. G equals G0 plus PO multiply QR uh, plus O uh, E uh, multiply K G G minus G0 multiply PN minus G the row uh, multiply key f where articles of the arrival zero initial humus po plant remain the uh, coefficient of humification or the organic fertilizers the minor mineralization coefficient the function of aerodibility. Workers of agricultural should strive for a deficit free balance of humus. Therefore, all agrotechnical requirements for growing crops Fertilizers, erosion control measures, and uh, mineralization measures must be observed. The amount of humus varies in uh, zonal types of soils, dependent on the geographic condition. This provision on the workflow change was first formulated by the Kuchayev in his work. Russian black ears in the break 1883. The humus content increase from tiger podvalic soils in the break 2-3% to the south to short podvalic gray forest in the break 4-6% and the trees of Chernozom in the break an average about 10 person and then also decrease to two four person in chestnut soils of dry steps and up to one two person in desert soils at the same time the ratio of the main component of the soil humus humic acid and the hydric acid is changing The content of humic acid increased with increasing humus and the content of hydric acid on country decreases. Therefore, the ratio between the content of humic acid and the hydric acid of the ratio of the carbon of humus and the hydric acid is of very important for characterizing the organic part of the soil, table 10 in the break. This volume of the Chernozome to for gray forest and the chestnut soils, one for soil located to the south or north, less one. Table 10, average content and composition of humus of common 
soil types person in the break according to the data Kononova, Alexandrova, Vilchikova, and the Kutova. 1964. On the slide, you see soil content humus related to carbon content, humic acid, palmic acid, the ratio of humic acid to palmic acid. Palmic acid actively participate in the transfer of the chemical element from the mineral part of soil to the mobile state. Humic acid in small dust affect the development of plants as growth promoters. Therefore, a study of the nature of the organic part of the soil, the condition of genesis, and the regulation of the distribution of humic substances is an important task for soil science. Thank you for attention. Так, Аннель Абдулла, что-то вы не подключили свои камеры. Так, Ильясова, Абдулла, Таскин, Абдулла, Рашитова, Абдулла, Рашитова. Ну, следующий, знаете, когда... Подключиться.